Suppose you think this is funny. Well, I'm not giving up that either. Oops! Ooh, too salty. Gadget won't stop me this time. My plan is perfect. Agents, are you ready? Ready, Dr. Claw. The killer sharks. Huh? The sea is their home, and you humans aren't welcome. <laughs> <laughs> you won't laugh when you're shark bait. Listen, Mac. There's never been sharks in this part of the ocean. Oh, yeah. Well, have a look for yourself. There's a shark. I think I'm getting the hang of this. Your time is almost up. Gadget, my mechanical shark will finish you. Hurry, Uncle Gadget! Hello, Penny! Hello, Brain! Wowzers, that must be the top secret gadget phone. Is that you, Chief? You're where? Right away, Chief. Go, go, Gadget, sail! Bowsers! I said Gadget, sail! Salty enough. Uncle Gadget, are you all right? Of course, Penny. But look at your surfboard. A shark did that. The, the prophet was right. Oh, there you are. What's up, Chief? Here's your assignment, Gadget. Dr. Claw <gasps> trying to take over Island. We'll use as missile base. Stop him. This message will self-destruct. Now get right on it, Chief. A terrible rainstorm is coming to the island. Another prediction. Well, I'm not interested. I have work to do. Oh, no! That guy was right. It rained. Oh, why do I put up with him? Beware of the volcanoes. You must leave the island. But those volcanoes have been inactive for years. But he was right about the shark. Now they're starting to worry, Dr. Claw. <laughs> this island is going to be mine. What about the volcano? I'll give them a demonstration now. 
Okay, Dr. Claw. Here it goes. <laughs> well, Penny, duty calls. <laughs> the prophet was right again. <laughs> What's going on? Well, Penny, the destruction of the island has begun. Run for your lives while there's still time. <laughs> At least he's a good prophet. Maybe he could lead us to Dr. Claw. Maybe you're right, Penny. <laughs> yes, Gadget. Follow him to your doom. <laughs> to be along here somewhere. There it is. That must be the prophet's place. Welcome, <laughs> fools. Hello there, Mr. Prophet. Leave now, Gadget. There's no place for you here. How do you know my name? Uh, I, I'm a prophet. I know everything. Oh, yes, of course. The island is doomed. Leave quickly while there's still time. Wait! I have a few questions. My computer book should tell us exactly how much time we have left. Wait a minute. This says the volcano isn't going to erupt. <gasps> Only way the volcano will erupt is if it's set off with explosives. We'd better tell Uncle Gadget. I can predict everything. That's incredible. For example, you are about to have a nasty accident. Whoa! <laughs> Wowzers, that was a close call. It's not over yet. I feel another one coming. Soon. <laughs> Amazing. How do you do it? I see no danger. Right again. I knew it. The Prophet is a mad agent. Thanks again, Mr. Prophet. You've been most helpful. I guess we'll see you tonight at the farewell luau for the islanders. Do you have a headache? Maybe you've been concentrating too hard. Yes, uh, maybe I have. I'll see you at the luau, Inspector. Good. Maybe it will help you relax. Let's go, Penny. Last. You failed again, Prophet. I'm sorry, Dr. Claw. Gadget is just too smart. He is an idiot. <coughs> Finish him at the luau tonight. <coughs> Give him one of our lucky pineapples. <laughs> Stay close to Uncle Gadget, Brain. I think that phony prophet may try again. <laughs> Wait till Gadget bites into this one. Boom! <laughs> Good evening, Mr. Prophet. Hello, Inspector. I must warn you, there's a great deal of danger ahead for you. Take this. A pineapple? A lucky pineapple. Once you eat it, nothing will harm you again. Oh. Thank you very much. Hey, that's my lucky pineapple. Come back. <laughs> we just heard the end of Gadget, Dr. Claw. Good. Take the pineapples to the volcano and wait for further instructions. What's he up to? I'd better get a closer look. Dr. Claw's 
Kaido's plan. He'll set off the volcano to make everyone leave the island. You're a naughty little girl, aren't you? Who are you? He's the god of the volcano. <laughs> Where are you taking me? Put me down! You're not a prophet, you're a mad agent. Ah, but I see danger ahead for you when we set off the volcano. <laughs> I've got to get out of here. Hula girl went. There she goes. And she dropped her flower. I'd better give it back to her. Stop! Come back! You dropped your flower! Now you've dropped your way! Come back! Little hula girl! Huh? This is getting serious. Little hula girl, where are you? You seem to have left your... your... your clothes behind. Huh? There are only two possibilities. She finds it too warm tonight, or her clothes are too big. your clothes! Please come here and put them on! Oof. The end is close for you, you Gadget. <laughs> Prophet, you have 15 minutes to load the volcano with pineapple bombs. Then I press the plunger and the volcano erupts. <laughs> sacrifice of these pineapples to the god of the volcano. Oh, well, let me help you, my friend. I'll take this one right away. These pineapples have bombs in them, Brain. We'd better tell Uncle Gadget. Brown. No! That's right, Brain. You catch them and I'll defuse them. I think of that before. Mr. Prophet, would you go up to the mouth of the volcano and perform this secret incantation to save the island? Why, of course, right away. Just 30 seconds, and the volcano blows up. Mighty 
spirit of Volcano Island, show me a sign. With pleasure. Goodbye, Inspector Gadget. <laughs> <laughs> is a busy man, but he couldn't have gone far. Go, go, gadget binoculars! Aha! There he is. And he seems to be having a little trouble with his truck. I'd better go help him. Go, go, gadget copter! to use my computer book to try and locate that phony prophet. Oh, no! According to this, there's a huge bomb in the big volcano. That's where the phony prophet is going. We'd better call for help. Chief Quimby, come in. Chief Quimby. Mr. Prophet! Mr. Prophet! What? do I do gadget. There he goes. But I don't think he finished fixing this. <laughs> Tire. Thanks for picking us up, Chief Quimby. You're welcome, Penny. Now, you say there's a huge bomb in the big volcano? Well, uh, that's what Uncle Gadget said. Well, don't worry. We'll take a shortcut. <laughs> I need some fast transportation. Go, go, gadget skates! Oh! Mr. Prophet! Mr. Prophet! I want you to know you were right three times! Yeah! Excellent. The Prophet is leading Gadget right into my clutches. Is it ready? Yes, Dr. Claw. Good. Very good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no! I better get out of here. <laughs> Gadget's coming this way. Don't worry about him. Dr. Claw has started the bomb. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. I'll have you loose in a second. It's just a matter of removing a few of these cables. Oh, no! Uncle Gadget is standing beside that huge bomb, and it's about to explode! Come on, Brain! What are you doing here? We wanted to make sure you were okay. Of course I am. Why shouldn't I be? Curse you, Gadget. You've beaten me again, but I'll get you next time. Congratulations, Gadget. Thanks, Chief. What did I do? 
You captured these two mad agents and defused this huge bomb before Dr. Claw could detonate it. Well, with Inspector Gadget on the job, the outcome is, uh, predictable? <laughs> <laughs> burned out. No problem, Penny. Be careful, Uncle. Most accidents happen at home. That's right, Penny. So always use a sturdy ladder. Loose carpets can cause nasty falls. Right again. <laughs> Wowzers! Uh Uncle! You forgot to turn off the power. Uh, I was just giving you a demonstration of what can happen if you don't. Would you believe I was practicing my swan dive?